Cayugas, California, North Ocean Avenue, the main drag. Let's do a walk through and see what's going on here. Dan alive. Dan vision. Let's check out what's going on with this little small town in Ocean Town. They got an old Cayugas Tavern live entertainment. It's got a card room. But we can't go in there. No, not because there's scary Indians. It's just because it's closed. There is nobody in there. It's closed down. Pretty cool though. Oh. Well, this one, this part's open. I guess it's still open. I don't want to get wrong information, but you need cash only. Yeah, poor guy. Didn't brush enough, lost his teeth. It looks to appears that the saloon is open. Oops. Got Rockview Realty. Come here and buy yourself an ocean front property. The prices are down, value up. Looks like this is some kind of a museum, Cayuga's History Museum. Once was or is going to be. It's for lease, huh? So much for museum. Highway one and rentals. Got more real estate here. More homes. Vacation rentals. Remember when antiques, vintage clothing, etc. Take a step back in the sidewalk here and get a good look at it. Number one, Antique Mall. Let's just pan across the street. We'll walk up that side in a bit. Wood Home and Garden. So we got all the real estate offices downtown here. More antiques. A lot of antiques. Must be the main antique place. Got a warehouse full of antiques probably find things in there that we had growing up hmm. take a quick look here radio flyer that's cool Dan Alive, Dan Vision should be called Sidetrack Vision. I can get sidetracked very easily from what the intended goal was for a day. And that intended goal was First Castle. Closes at 4. Here it is going on 1 o'clock and I still haven't made it. Just need to linger around for more cover more things a hey, little gas station you know they're, they're paying a lot up here for gas 439 I've seen as much as 479 up uh, Cambria so they're really sucking it to the folks up here to come touring through here I wonder if the residents got a special discount all right let's walk 
walk the other side of the street. I got surf companies, Cayuga's surf company. Handy counter over there. Oh, there's a pier. Let's take a walk up that way. But first, on the beach, bed and breakfast. Look at that sand castle. Has lawn art. Looks pretty cool. How about that? Some place that might be fun to stay at, Lady T. Nice entrance. And the ground parking. Van accessible. I mean, Daniel Van can make it. Ducky's Chowder House. Skateboards. Old school skateboards. Lions Club, pan back, take a look, see, that's a little restaurant area, I guess the question is how many skateboards can, old skateboards can you fit in a Mini Cooper, a newer version of Mini Cooper, we'll soon find out, but we're not staying. Here is a Cayuga's Historical Museum right there. And here's its pier. Let's go out a little bit on the pier here. I was up ways a little bit earlier taking some shots. And there has been a lot of debris wash up in a form of wood. Where does it all come from? Trees, branches, just littered. But some of the beach goers, goers make some uh, pretty good uh, art. And of course, way out there in the distance, that is Morro Bay, Morro Rock. Let's zoom in on it. I just left there not that long ago. Looks like the surf's too high here. We have guys out there doing it though. Old school pier, railroad ties. North side of the pier. Seems to be a nice little community. Shoreline, low tide. Cayugas, California. Morro Bay in the distance. I'm going to pause and uh, we'll pick this up as I uh, stroll downtown again. We'll be back. Dan Alive, Dan Vision. All right, we're back. Okay, you go surf company. C 
cool mural here. That's why we started this video off here. Shows the pier. Shows Cayuga's Landing. There's a general store. Back in the day, a horse and buggy. But what's even more cool? James A. Cass did the wharf. A year later, the landing and the Cass House. And then James A. Cass. That, that's what he looked like. Probably somewhere in that picture. I doubt there were surfboards at the time. But it's even more cool. Looks like they're gonna have a party over here. But this is the Cass House. How cool this whole structure is. They're unloading this van with the goodies. Two 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 North Ocean. It is a cast house. It's pretty cool. Oh, you can even stay here. It now it is a bed and breakfast or hotel of some sort. Pretty cool. Cass House. Home of Captain James Cass. You need to redo that sign. And now it's owned. It has a place to stay. Cool. This is the grill, oh, check it out. You even have a place to grab something to eat. The grill, the bakery. How cool is that? And there's that Coyotes gas station, very expensive. Let's walk on the west side of North Ocean. Nobody already seen this bed and breakfast right here on the beach. I just stayed it. It's like a pretty cool place to stay. Well kept, nicely manicured. On the beach. Bed and breakfast. Registration nine eight. That's the phone number. All right. Here we got an old school barber shop. Maybe I need a haircut. Styling. Yeah. Yeah. This old guy. Oh, stay out of the sun. Now, uh huh? Look at that. 67 Super Sport. Probably up for Pismo Beach car show. Cayuga's Barber and Beauty Shop. This is Schooner's Wharf, Steak, Seafoods, Cocktails. You guys rain gear on. This guy here, he's lost his hook. That'd be the captain. Ooh, look at this. Pretty cool. I'm gonna have to get a shot from outside of the street here. Looks like uh, Schooners. Part of the Schooners Wharf. How about that? There's a little 
Use your chair to relax them. Pretty cool. And a balcony up there was looking at the ocean. You got keg chairs. How cool are they? <laughs> Need to spend more time in these little towns. Basically spent the whole week in Morro Bay. Back in the day, they didn't have PVC coming out of the barrel. It has an antique look, but... Picture time. Alright, let's mosey on down. Okay. Cold brew coffee and smoothies. Sit outside and enjoy a latte. Dinner nightly starts at 5 o'clock. Old school dining. Tablecloths, cloth napkins. Cafe della Via. Sounds Italian. Of course, every little town needs to have souvenirs, shops. Here's one right here. Surf and sport. Free tide books. Somebody's walking a little faster. Can you go to collect the beach culture, gifts, gallery? Skipper's Family Restaurant. Breakfast, lunch, dinner. Closed. Uh, it's about ready to say. Would have been nicer than a two egg McMuffin deal for five bucks at the McDonald's. Something you won't see at Pismo Beach Classic Car Show. Rainbow Bank, never heard of them. There we go. Super Sport. What a way to end. Dan on live broadcast from Cayuga's downtown. Dan on Vision Live. Seems like I ended the video too soon. We need to add on McLaren. Which is probably something rare up in these parts of town. There you have it. Down in our neighborhood. No, it's out of Chicago. Our neighborhood, Newport Beach, Huntington Beach. These things are a penny a dozen. Right here, Cayugas. There it is. Your McLaren. Not yours. A McLaren. Dental Live, Dental Vision.